Welcome back, guys. We're going to hook up this train line over to Scottsdale Forest. Then we're going to have the train down here that is bringing uh, bricks up to Fargo and Scottsdale. We'll have that pick up logs over there as well. We'll sell those logs over to here, to Murfreesboro Sawmill. We will continue up with planks to uh, Fort Collins Tools Factory and then we'll pick up more logs down here so we'll actually take the tools down drop them off at our um, uh, San Antonio port our uh, transport hub and then we'll pick up more logs here and sail them down to there as well so it's a it's a pretty big process, but it's going to be a very, very profitable route, I think. Right, so uh, let's get to it. We need to put a station in here. And this just needs to be a cargo terminus. Um, well, let's make it 320 meters. Oh, we don't have any money right now. Uh, we have a little bit of money to work with, but not a lot, but it should, I think, be enough. We are going to borrow everything that we can. 30 mil, so we have 11 million to work with right now. That should hopefully be fine. Um, let's turn you around like that. And get you in here. Alrighty, tracks, catenaries, yes. Uh, let's see, we want to come into here. That is beautiful. We'll come out here. And come into there. And then we might as well uh, make the crossing here, I suppose we do, just to have it. Uh, actually, no, we'll just pull this out like that for now, I think. Though we don't really need to. Uh, we don't really need signals either because we're just running one train right now but we might need signals later we might well need signals later so this line is going uh tallahassee fargo scottsdale uh then it'll go scottsdale east and all the way down to tallahassee now, why, why can't you get down there? Oh, it's just because of, oh, this did not correct, uh, connect correctly. So that makes sense. Uh, so there it should connect. And then we just need a double slip switch. And we still have that problem. And train 10 is that train. Okay. Um, so it's coming in there. And then it comes down here. What seems to be the problem here? So it's saying, oh, it's because Tallahassee is there twice. Duh. Uh, and train 10, we can just do this. And there are no warnings. And it'll go to Fargo with whatever it has. What does it have? Whoa. A little lag there, a little lag. Uh, it has 
68 bricks, okay. So that's fine. Now, I did have a few comments and they are very much appreciated. It was mentioned that here in Santa Ana port, we could tell our ships to wait for a full load forever. And that makes very good sense to me because then they will spread out, get their loads and and so on. And it was also mentioned that I have way too many trucks on here. So what does the rate say on this? 329. I think I'm going to keep these trucks on here for a little while. See if the demand doesn't go up when Fargo and Scottsdale start getting... Um, Oh, it is, it's already at 400 of 400, so it should, it should uh, clear itself, hopefully, hopefully. Okay, now we need a port uh, up here, and we actually need two terminals, uh, large two terminals, because we need one coming up and one coming down. So let's put that in there and put a little road up to here and hopefully that connects to that. Yes, it does. Then we need a port up here and this just needs one terminal. We can put that in something like there and put a road in. Okay. And then we basically need a new line. So a new line going from Tallahassee port to Murfreesboro port to Fort Collins port, I'm guessing, yes. And then to San Antonio port. Oh, and then we need a port down here as well. So one more port. Uh, also just with one. Like that. And a little road going down to that. We can make all of this look nicer later when we have a little bit more money to work with. So after San Antonio port, you go to Sacramento port. And then to Murfreesboro port. Back again. Okay. And at Tallahassee port, we can tell you to... Wait for a full load. And you could in reality use any, but I don't want to tell you to, because then we'll have probably three ships sitting there at the same time, or four ships sitting there at the same time, which means that these guys won't, won't be able to drop off. And I don't want that. So there. All right. I don't know if that's actually how it works, but it might be. Um, now, we need to buy a few ships, uh, buy vehicles. We're going to go with the Schaffhausens here. We're going to go with three of them for now, because we can't afford more than three. And we're going to put you on line one. As I didn't rename it. I'll do that. And up here, I certainly don't want you to be on the same terminals. And the same down here. Uh, Alright, you're on different terminals. I'll rename that in a second. Because another thing I want to do is find our uh, bricks train. 
and manage vehicles because I want to edit this train a bit. So right now it has a capacity of 180 and each carries 12. So that's 10 cars, that's 15 cars that it has on. Yep, it says right there. No need to count. Uh, so, and I want to add some box cars to this. Four, five, six, Seven. And eight. So 216 capacity. How many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, I think that's probably okay. I think I'll take one more off and add one more. We can just afford that. And it's mediocre, but that's fine. All right. So that'll mean that we get tools delivered to Sacramento and San Antonio as well. And do these lines accept tools? Yes, they do. Up here, this line will accept tools as well. Good. So that's everything going. All right, let's let the game run. Oh, and uh, let's rename that line one to cargo uh, ship. Uh, I'm going to say production tools um, uh, Murfreesboro. Okay. And the cargo rail delivery to Saxan. This is going to be brick tool delivery, Saxon. Okay. So we got, where are the Schaffhausens? They're there. We got some Schaffhausens. There they are. Look at that beauty. It's a cool ship too. I really like the ships. Well, I like everything in this game. It's just a cool game. It really, really is. Whoa. That was a bit of a dangerous maneuver. All right. Wow. Stop crossing in and out of each other's way like that. So let's see. Where the heck are we? Down here. Are you producing? You're producing. Do you have everything? Anything? Yes, you do. Good. Good, good, good. And you just drop some off. There's 27 sitting there. You're coming in with nine. Ooh, new uh, electric train. Expensive electric train. 12 mil. Not a lot of bricks that they're coming in with, but they're coming in with bricks. Uh, and that's fine. Now, this here, uh, manage line. Because in San Antonio, I have already told it what to do. 
down the other line, uh, manage line. Uh, didn't I say manage line and not manage vehicles? I think I did, but apparently not. Uh, manage line. In uh, Murfreesboro Port, you are... Uh, oh, in Tallahassee Port, uh, you are loading logs, unloading tools, I guess. Because then, uh, no, not unload tools yet, because we don't have any train for that down here yet. So just load that. In San Antonio Port, you unload, you load, you, unload, you don't load anything, you unload tools. And in Murfreesboro port, you load planks, unload logs. And in Fort Collins, you load tools, unload planks. Uh, in Sacramento port, you load logs, and in Murfreesboro port for the second time, you don't load anything, but you unload logs. Okay. Oh, we have some more money, so let's... Uh, take these ships and clone them so that we get some more on there. Okay, and we can actually clone again. Uh, clone. Phoenix Forest is not something that we're using, so that's fine. All right. Now, are we getting a queue of ships down here? We are. Which is fine, because they will spread out automatically. Now, these cars can do 40, and the road can handle 40. I am pretty sure. Uh, so it's this one, isn't it? The 60 can handle. Even the small one can do 40, so. Don't think I can actually have this many trucks on here because they're just. They're just not fast enough. They can't transport enough. So this might mean that we instead set up a train line from here to here and drop off there. That could be an idea. Because we clearly can't handle this many trucks. Sell you. Sell you. Tell you they are going as often as a, and as full as they can so we just we just can't handle this many trucks Now what could allow us to handle as many trucks is to add a another uh, thing here, another loading platform, and have it load in two places. That might be a possibility. 
How much do you have on board now? 92, 99, 106, and then you'll be full. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know what could be really nice? Hook this up over here and bring crude all the way back up. Oh, we can't do that. We can't do that. Stupid me. But we could do it here. Whoa. What the heck is going on? Is it because I have this open? It's very bumpy right now. A little bit laggy, a little bit laggy. So we could do it here. Simply deliver crude here and not have the trains go up there. That could be a possibility. That could be a possibility. Uh, your rate is 512. That's too much. That's way too much. Okay. Hmm. Wow, we lost a lot of money here. As a water map, that's because of the new ships. It's fine. Uh, are you producing? Yes, you are. And down here. We have a ship waiting, and another ship waiting. Our train is up here. I'm going to pick up 120 logs. So we need to extend this train, there's no doubt about that. Uh, what's your rate? 47. Yeah, we, we, we need to extend this train. Um, manage vehicle. Um, edit it. Cargo, flat cars. Okay, we, we have enough money to get a little bit more on there. And what's sitting waiting down here? 26 only. Well, this is looking decent. You're picking up there. Good. You just picked up 64 planks. I like it. You're empty. Okay, you're bringing down 130 logs, I like it, this is going to make us a lot of money eventually. This train is now sitting here waiting, so I actually think I am going to manage this line and instead of in Tallahassee, we're going to say in... Uh, Scottsdale you, you're gonna have a foot load and in Tallahassee you're going to load if available we did get 59 tools on board okay uh, do we extend this train a little bit more I think we do uh, manage vehicles uh, and so that gets up there for 2.2 .2 million so we need some money we need some money 
And we certainly need more ships as well. Come on, give us some money. Almost there. There we go. So this train is now maxed out. And 74 logs. We definitely need more. We're coming up with 130 logs. We're going down empty. 494,000. So it's not much that we make from the logs there, but that's okay. Uh, what's the rate on the ships? 92. Uh, that's clone. And if we get some money, give us some money. Come on. You can do it. Right, I guess not right now. Okay. And tons of logs sitting there. And, uh, quite a lot of bricks sitting here. Um, didn't I tell you not to wait for a full load? Uh, yeah, only when going to Sacramento. Oh, oh, uh, you can't wait for a full node now. Uh, because we have no tools. So, load if available. And go. Oh, we have airplanes! Basically, the cash sinks of the game. Okay. Well, even though these trains or these trucks are going constantly, we still have quite a lot of stone sitting here, so that's kind of nice. You are at 400. Why is our transport dropping? I don't really understand that. I don't really understand that. Uh, let's repay some money. I do want more ships and I will... Uh, but I think... What's the rate on these ships now? Um, 105. What's the rate on the train? Where's the train? Where the hell is the train? There. The rate on the train is 201. So yeah, it's ships that we need right now. We are getting decent amounts of bricks down here now. Which is great. Okay. We actually have quite a lot of money. Uh, well, not anymore. Um, okay, so you're... You must be one of the new ones. Uh, manage vehicle. We are going to clone ships as we can. I know that I paid a little bit back, so we could technically take that out. But let's just wait for some money to come in, if it ever does. I really hope it does. <laughs> Uh, 
I really, really hope it does. Come on. It's not getting up there, is it? Not right now, anyway. I thought it went the right way, but it went the wrong way. Come on. I get so excited when I see the 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 numbers change drastically that I just click. I can't clone clone yet. They cost like 1.5. Around there. Oh, Sacramento. Oh, did you see that? It was just up at 3 mil. And then it went down to minus five. Well, 500,000. Man. All right, that's three new ships on there. That's a start. That's a start. We lost money. We even lost money on the rail here. That was a bad, bad year. Lost money on everything. But here, even though we spent 3.7 million, we made a profit of 4.9. So this was just a fluke, horrendous year. A fluke, horrendous year. Okay. So, Sacramento, uh, you still just want the four goods. You'll soon be getting tools and going to be wonderful. And so will San Antonio. So San Antonio doesn't want a lot of tools, but it wants some. Now the question is, does San Antonio want tools where we are delivering them? That is the question. Uh, yeah, they actually do. Down here. Okay, good. Now, we might need to put more trucks on this because there is quite a lot of sitting here. So, manage vehicle. And I think we'll get two more on here. What's the rate of this line now? Eight? Uh, that can't be right. Uh, Ten? How is the rate 10? That doesn't seem right at all. Alright, a lot just came in. I don't really have room to extend this platform or add buildings or anything, so we kind of just need to keep up. Kinda sorta are right now. So you're all right, it's almost gone now. Everything is almost gone. Okay. You're going to sit there because you're missing one fuel. Passenger train is full. So that's another thing that I had some comments about. Is my passenger lines that I should either just shut them down. Or uh, add more cars and reduce the number of trains. And I think you're absolutely right. Uh, I just don't have the means to do it right now. I just don't have the means to do it right now. Right, we have planks coming up here. Oh, there's some tools. Not a lot, but some. We have 55 tools. Okay. And you have consumers in Sacramento and San Antonio. Um, 
does whoa it's very very laggy today uh does sony mail not want tools yes it does uh so this line uh manage line and sony mail annex oh you can't do tools so you know what i think we will replace these vehicles with the Benz Tarpaulin trucks. Yeah. Uh, let's repay a little bit of loan. We've repaid three and a half mil. So what's the rate on this now? 166. Oh, and I forgot. I changed the vehicles, but I didn't tell them to only load. Uh, uh, I want you to load. Uh, bricks and tools and I'll load nothing so now Sunnyvale becomes a customer as well provided that Sunnyvale wants tools where we're delivering them and it kind of does so yeah you're covering everything good and Sunnyvale wants 47 tools nice okay this is good. This is good. Let's turn that off. Ooh, and we have a lot of money. Uh, let's see what the rate is here now. 166. Um, let's clone. 181. Clone. 196 Okay So San Antonio, Sacramento and Sunnyvale are really getting some love right now Mostly San Antonio because it will be getting three different uh, kinds of stuff we picked up 108 construction materials and 38 tools. What's sitting here? 664 uh, construction materials going to Sacramento and a little bit of stuff going via San Antonio. Okay. Now, I just want to see because uh, this is called Sunnyvale, isn't it? Yeah, it is. This is going to be Sunnyvale uh, Fuel Depot. And this is going to be Sunnyvale. And then I thought I had a station called no, that's Sacramento South and that's Sacramento. Okay. That's fine. All right. So now you should have Sunnyvale on there as well. Yes. Why is Sacramento only 23? Ah, it is going up, so it's fine. But we are going to call this one here and we'll come back in the next one and see how our new lines are doing. They should be doing very, very well, especially the shipping line. Um, especially the shipping line. Uh, let's just uh, boom. Uh, clone. Oh, damn it. Just lost a lot of money. 
Ooh, the Snyder PB2. Cool, cool. Come on. There we go. So now this matches the train. Or it should. Because the train line has a lit rate of 193 now. So it should be fine. It should be fine. And you just pick up a load every time. We have 60 sitting down there. So that line should be turning a profit right now. Uh, yeah, rail delivery, bricks, Far, uh, Fargo and Scottsdale, 1.6 million profit. So it is turning a profit. That is awesome. That is awesome. The new trip line isn't turning a profit yet, for sure, no. But it definitely will. It definitely will. It's going to be awesome. So, up here, we want 51 tools. Uh, we want 105, so that's uh, 156, excuse me. That's uh, 188. So that should be around 200. And that seems right to me. So all we need is this to go up, and it will. So this is great. This is great, and we can increase the rates as needed. So you're coming up with 65, you're, you're coming up with 65, both of you are coming up with 65, nice. Oh, this is going to be awesome. This is going to be awesome. So yeah, uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.